somewhat clean plate. Put that on the side stuff. Starting to lay stuff out on the table. And then it's pretty clean in here. Just have to put away their stuff. So we're good before. And obviously I already did the outside because I have my wreath that I made a few years ago and I'm gonna have to I think spruce up a little bit this year because it's looking sad. And then we have mums there, mums and a little pumpkin there. Alright, so I'll kind of show you what we have like haul style. So this is the only new stuff I've gotten so far. Actually no, there's a few more things. So I'll start with just like this type of stuff. That's gross. Well, that needs to be thrown away. But we apparently have a oven mitt, like apocalypse coming. And then I have a lot of um, just towels and stuff. And in all honesty, I've used these for quite a few years. So not sure I will be keeping them. Like this one I love. So we'll see what I keep. This is actually a bathroom one. We grabbed this from... <laughs> Hobby Lobby one year. It says bless our family. And then these candles are old, old, old. These are from Kohl's. So there's two of those. This is a little pumpkin with a little scarecrow that I put outside on our little hook. And then I have a lot of mums in um, styrofoam. So I only have two left it looks like. And I used to have a ton so I'm probably gonna have to buy some more to do that. I have some plates that we got last year. Uh, Trevor doesn't have one, so I may have to see if they have something similar and get those again. I have just this like, you know, vase filler, leaves, that type of stuff. I have acorn salt and pepper shakers from Target last year. I got them for like 70%. Um, these I think were from Hobby Lobby. I don't quite remember. Uh, so there's this one. These are from Michael's. These ones. So all of those. Um, these are from Pottery Barn. I only have two left. This is Hobby Lobby. This is Dollar Tree. But, I mean, it's seen better days. So I might have to be getting rid of that one. These are Hobby Lobby. This, I think, was Target last year. Yeah, Target clearance. I got it for 50% off. This was TJ Maxx, yep. This was Target clearance last year. I don't remember what I got them for. I think these ones I waited for 70%. Uh, this little owl was from Bath and Body Works, apparently. Uh, these are from Michael's, like their little dollar section. Like this one has seen better days. So we'll see if I keep those. This is Hobby Lobby. This was Target. Yep, last year. And I just put candy in this. Or if I get the kids like fall treats from Target, I grab those. This was Target. I liked their fall, this like gold collection they had last year. Uh, this I've had for years. I don't remember where I got it from, but I always turn it and just have it be a pumpkin because I'm not big on the like jack-o'-lantern thing. Another Michaels pumpkin. Another Hoblob pumpkin. Uh, I made this a long time ago. It's a cheap pumpkin, like the light up ones from Target, and I put mums on it. And I like the way it looks. It's pretty. I may get a big pumpkin and do another one this year. And then um, this little candle holder, which I'm hoping my little Bath and Body Works candles that my mom just got me will fit in. Oh, it looks like they do, like a glove. So that's cool. And then the new stuff I got this year so far. So we grabbed this little thing for Aubrey and Ellie's room from um, Yankee Candle. And this is actually a Halloween thing. But we grabbed that and then this was free with it. And then my mom the other day brought me three sweater weather candles, the little mini ones. And I'm glad that they fit in that pumpkin because now this will last me for the season in that. I found this at the dollar spot the other day for $3. I found this at the dollar spot the other day for $3. So I may actually put the little mums that I have in here. Like, do something to make them poof up. Like, you know, put something on the bottom. So that may be where I'm going with that. And then this electric wax warmer, which looks like a mason. 
sorry, my memory card filled up. I don't remember the last time that happened. So this was $16.49 to $4.94, and it just looks like the mason jar with the gold lid. And I have a lot of scentsy things. So now I'm gonna run downstairs and see if I can find all of my like plugins and see what fall scents I have and my scentsy warmer. I think I only have a Halloween one, but I'm gonna check anyways. So I'm in my storage room now. So I found a big sweater weather candle from last year. Thanksgiving Harvest, which is sweet cinnamon pumpkin. Uh, the sign I put out every year, it's in like a gold frame and it's just a printable. It says, in all things, give thanks. Um, tons of vase filler. So I have that. And then now I'm going to look through all of this stuff and see what I have that is a fall scent. I'll take my scent portable out. It's Christmas. Christmas. So we have an acorn. It's a present. A tree. I have my car jar. Harvest Gathering. It's a new one from this year. Um, yep, there's another one. So as you can see, we have tons of stuff. And like this, we might be able to make work for fall. So I'll bring it up even though it was like a Christmas thing. Bottom shelf. I don't know what that is. So this is something I normally bring up for Halloween. I have my acorn candle. Um, is this a fall scent? Apple pumpkin. And then I have the sparklies I must have bought last year. So yay for me for thinking ahead. And then this little sign that says hello fall. And then I will need some candle holders for these two candles. So I'm going to bring some of this stuff up. Well, I wanted to move this, but I don't know how I did it, but it, somehow it's like stuck behind my... Um, oven so this is not coming out this is just gonna have to stay here like I could like put this here as my spoon rest but I just think this is so pretty to have it be a spoon rest so I'm just gonna put a little candle here or a pumpkin excuse me um, I want to get one more of these for um, like vegetable oil and then they kind of conceal all the cords and stuff back there I mean I guess I could get this and put this away So I think that's as good as it's going to get. I think I'm going to get another one of these to put here for my vegetable oil. And then I'll have my Scentsy here. And then I'm going to get another one of these for pepper and put that here because I don't like the way that my pepper shaker looks. And then I'm going to put a little pumpkin here so I just need to find a small one. So then there's one little area that's pretty much all set and I'm just going to start a list of all the things I want to get. But I'm just playing around and putting stuff here and I don't know if it'll stay. I don't know if I'll move things around but it's just how I decorate. Uh, I did like the food stuff, so like the uh, plates I put in there. Um, oh, and I, put, I cleaned up the salt and pepper shaker and put those here. Then I realized that this one is missing the plug. So I'm going to have to take this with me to like Walmart or Target and see if I can find a cheap salt and pepper shaker that the plug fits in here and buy it so that I can have that. So that'll stay there. And then we always have fresh fruit there. That just has to stay there. There's no way around it. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to start kind of putting things out as I see fit. I'm going to take this outside real quick and put this on uh, our little nail we have outside where we always put something festive. So we added a few things up there. I'm not in love with that. It's just not full enough for me. I like a fall thing to be like really, really full. But I do like that that purpley color is like the purpley color here. Um, that's pretty much stayed the same. Obviously my table is getting cleaned out. Um, in the back I put some pumpkins and I want to raise them up so I need to get like a uh, book or something like that. I have a pumpkin. 
Normally I have the mums here, but obviously I don't. So I'll probably get some mums and replace that. And then I have our acorn, the same exact thing on that side. I have a few things over here, some pumpkins, that candle, our scentsy type thing, uh, my little sign. And then I've been putting everything in this bin as I'm done so that I know whenever I'm done, this is where the decor will be. And then I just put that there. Nothing exciting because this isn't really any cute area at all. Um, I have my magazines there, which I'm hoping to go through soon. I have that bless our home and the little pumpkin. Um, I could put another pumpkin there once I get the magazines down. I have these two little candle holders from Target. And then I put that there. And Lemire had to stay because I just couldn't get rid of him. So we just got back. Excuse dinner, still on the table. I have to clean the table. But we just got back from Target and I found this clearance hurricane for like $4.48. And I just put some leaves that we had in there and my candle. And it's just really, really cute. And then I just moved my um, apples to the kitchen. Pumpkins. You can do it. Go ahead. Just don't put your fingers in front. Okay. Oh, your fingers are in front. You gotta move your fingers. Good. I'm moving my friend in. Then is we miss it. That pumpkin. You say this. Good pizza. No, that's not it. Take your picture. Okay. It's a pumpkin. <laughs> Mommy, let me take your picture. It's a nine, seven, eight, nine. It's a seven. Under a comma. Take a picture. 